welcome back to my channel. I'm here with my bestie for the resty, Mac, Mac Dizzle. Dizzle. I'm in California, so we get to be together frequently over the next couple weeks. Yeah, today we are going to do a little how well do we know each other game. We're gonna take a hit for every answer that we don't know. Honestly, I'm pretty confident. I don't wanna go into it like this, but I feel like we're gonna do pretty well. And so I feel like I don't think I'm gonna be that high by the end of So this. we came up with this list of questions together. Right. And while we were coming up with the list, there were some that I was like, <laughs> right? like, I don't really know yeah. the answer to this. Like but... a few. But like, I feel like It'll... I can use context clues to put together a pretty Yes, good yeah. I know. I'm sure there's going to be some that we don't know. Yeah. But I feel like majority, we're going to be, we're going to do okay. Slay. So, I think we yeah. should start with a bong rip. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Wait, can I? Yeah, I want to start with a bong rip and not a dab. Great. I because will pack up each one. In a turn of events, this is going to be my, my mechanism of consumption. Yeah. Yeah, which, you know, if you've been around for pretty much any length of time, it's kind of crazy to think about me Using, taking a dab. Yeah, as your primary. I do not like the child. For a video. I don't like the child yelling in the background. I love the child. Oh, when I pulled up, she was shrieking. I'm happy. I'm happy with the child screaming. I don't want it on here. <laughs> Should we roll the windows up? They're playing. They're having fun, but I don't want the kids Why aren't screaming. Why are you in fucking the... school? Go it's inside. Summer. It's, it's cold. It's summer. What the fuck is my lighter? Well, you just had it. I did. A tale is old as time. Should I just be like, hey, how long are you planning on being out here playing? <laughs> I'm trying to film. Hi, little girl. I'm trying to film a YouTube you video where I smoke weed. <laughs> oh my god. She's an animal. She literally is an animal. <laughs> you should have let me go first. How am I gonna follow that? It's like when they used to call Michael Jordan and Scottie Pippen after him. <laughs> Why are we doing that? <laughs> Alphabetical. Everybody's like Michael Jordan, and, and it's like Scottie, Scottie Pippen. Pippen. Uh, it was also really good. Yeah, right. <laughs> Who was also uh, the other half of the iconic duo. <laughs> Thank you, sister. For spilling. spilling. Okay, that, was that wasn't still, so bad. That was still impressive. <laughs> that was good. Oh, that's we a cute got a little lavender case. Not as cute as my fun shaped one. Uh, yeah, and also that looks actually like it's actually protective of your phone. It might be. Because the cute ones, you know, they don't actually protect your phone. Chat, so I have to yeah, respond yeah, to yeah, it yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. Yep. It's an accident and opening. Yeah. Ah, that moment when you accidentally open somebody's DM and now you have to respond right away, otherwise they're gonna see. Why do they do that? Why I see. And also, you can't, you know how you can mark it as unread? It's not unread for them. Like, it's only unread for you. <laughs> Honestly, shout out to this little girl. They're just, I just want everybody listening to know, yes, there is gonna be some child in the background. There's we can't do anything playing. about it. We are not affiliated with this child. This child and there's a fence in between us and this child. She cannot see us. She they can't they see cannot, us. I don't, we don't know what they're, they cannot see us. Honestly, I don't know the gender of this child. I don't there's know. multiple, I think. There's well. maybe. So, no, there is. Or it could just be a child with split personalities. Period. And it could. Scary. Never say never. Okay, should we just start from the top? Okay, what is my favorite strain? I don't think you have a favorite strain. I but, don't think I have a favorite but, strain either. But I would say you probably prefer something like sativa dominant. That's an interesting... When you're like during the day. Sure, 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 sure. Yeah, because sure, sure. you have a hard time with that, whereas at night, I'm sure you're probably down to just get hit in the face yes. with an indica. Uh, once the evening hits, yeah. I'm like, I'm, I need to be as high as possible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm constantly, you know, they, they say that too, like you're always like chasing, which mm -hmm. just kind of sounds fucked up because that really sounds like drug addict shit. But I am always, I'm always chasing that, like just get, get me fucked Cooked. up. Cooked. But you're right, I don't have a favorite strain. I do know yours. Yeah. Well, I hope I know yours. I have one came to mind immediately. It's Blue Dream. Yeah, that was my favorite for a really, really long time. Do you have time. a new, a new favorite? I don't have a new favorite. Okay. I, I just don't like... Obsess over Blue Dream. Yeah, yeah, because yeah. it's a sativa, and I'm yeah. not a huge sativa girl anymore. Yeah. So we didn't have to take a hit for that one. Right. We got them right. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm already selling that bong rope. Definitely <laughs> got me a little high, so fuck. 
If I could order only one thing forever, like food wise, what would it be? Okay, so I was thinking about this. There, okay, there is one that stands out. Okay. Oh my God, I hope it's right, I really do. I feel like it would be like a crab boil. Okay. That's not forever? it. Forever? No, okay, fuck. Fish forever? No, 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 no. Okay, <laughs> Korean barbecue. Us. That's okay. Solid. That's solid. That's solid. That's solid. That's solid. Okay. That's solid. That counts. That counts. That yeah, counts. yeah, yeah. But you eating Korean barbecue every day for the rest of your life definitely checks out. Yes, 100%. Yes. Oh my god. Rice paper, yeah. green tea salt. All the extras. Eggs. Yeah. Green tea salt? That sounds so good. It's basically just matcha powder and salt. That sounds It's phenomenal. so fucking good. Oh my it's god, so sad. good. What would you order forever <laughs> if you could only order? So we're talking about where it could be an establishment. Sure, a restaurant or Or like a type a of meal. restaurant or a meal. That's I was thinking of like a Cause you kinda got both because you only get one thing at Korean barbecue. It's Korean barbecue. Yes. I would say maybe mm. And you don't have to take my you don't have to take my recent change in uh, Okay, diet. Well, see, so recent change with without recent change in diet, it's chicken strips and fries. Period. Done. But considering recent change in diet. Yeah. Okay. I'm torn a little bit between hibachi. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. How did I forget about that? I was thinking about only about chicken tenders. <laughs> I know. Yes. Hibachi. <laughs> hibachi. Yes. Um, but I also feel like you've grown to really enjoy barbecuing with Spoons? Yeah, I do. But I, I do. think you would choose hibachi over the barbecue. I, I would. I would. I absolutely. I do love barbecue. And, but yeah, barbecue is more. It's like also. It's an activity. Yeah, like exactly. he's out there grilling or smoking or whatever, or whatever. And I'm making like the mac and cheese little, yeah. and the. So that's like it's like an experience. Chicken tenders way up there too. Mm -hmm. But abs. Yes, hibachi. Yeah. Forever. <laughs> What is my favorite method of consumption? I think this is this is also you know, I'm gonna say consistently if you could only do one thing forever, it would be a bong rip. Yes. Yes. Because I recently I use this constantly. A lot. But absolutely I as far as like tried and true yes. consistency. And I would also say the same thing for you. Yeah. Bonus points if you tell them what kind of bong rip. A bong rip with a little bit of wax on and top. Period. <laughs> a bong rip with just a little bit of I'm going to just take one right now for fun. Oh, I love that for you. What is my favorite potato chip flavor? I also need to think about this. Do you? Okay. It is kind of a toss up. For you? Yeah. Between two. Okay, so this is tough because I feel like you, in general, just love like a spicy chip. Yes. That's that's one of the toss up. Okay. I, I know just, it does not matter what kind of spicy. Yes. I love a spicy chip. Yes. I know spicy chip is safe for you. You love all the spicy chips. I don't know. I don't know the other one. Um, it's okay. Spicy chip is great. What what was the second one? Salt and vinegar. <laughs> Fuck, dude. And I, yours. No. Yes. Salt and vinegar. Yes. Salt and vinegar. <laughs> which I was thinking about it and I'm like she all I you always eat because I feel like I would know if you didn't like salt and vinegar because sure, you would say chips. no yes because that's my favorite anytime you have salt so, and vinegar chips I am yes you them. always do yeah. well so I feel like you kind of have to take a ball group for that no <laughs> yeah. that's not fair <laughs> I said spicy <laughs> half half right half okay. right we'll both take there's right this fucking fat glob sitting in here doing nothing so where is the lighter going found it it went into my poo swatcha <laughs> we'll just pretend like you had some smoke in there. I know it happened because I can taste it, but I think I, think I could you do it. I know it happened because I can taste it. I know, I know it was <laughs> But I, it disappeared. I did not see it. How old was I <coughs> the first time I smoked? Was I as old as that small child screaming? A little bit older. <laughs> you were 12? It was 12. And you were, oh, I felt a lot more confident about this before this moment right here. I feel like you were 60. Yes. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. The summer before my senior year. Oh, great, because you're young. Yes. yes. We're, I was young, but you were super young. I was grade. literally, I skipped kindergarten. Yeah. That was supposed to be one so year back. That's, that's so you. That's so, that's so you. Mac Dizzle to skip kindergarten. Skip she's fucking, she's shit. incredible. Where is my favorite place to smoke? Well, okay, so I think there's a, an umbrella term, but I don't feel like it's a good enough answer. Okay. I would say that, like, in nature. Okay, okay, specify what type of nature is my favorite. 
I feel like the beach or the forest. Trees. Trees, okay, yes. I'll take a hit for that one. Your favorite place to smoke. Yeah. I feel like you kind of said it. Here's the thing. <laughs> I feel like the place Joy likes to be stoned the most is in her own <laughs> On my fucking couch. <laughs> Literally, my like, like in her house where she has her snacks, her entertainment, her dogs, her safety, her safety. You know, like that's where Joy likes to get high is at her house. Oh fuck! <laughs> that was a good one. <laughs> that one makes up for the last one for sure. <laughs> I can't wait to watch that footage. <laughs> What size shoe am I? And this is actually difficult because my shoe size has changed since we've been friends. I'm only gonna assume that it got bigger. Yes, you would be right. You would be right, it got bigger. And I think it's like a nine and a half. No. 10. Nine. Flat. Wait, babe, wave at the camera when you're leaving. We can see it, kind of. Uh, All right, so I got so that wrong. You did get it wrong. Yeah, I can't do it. Nine and a half is too big, but eight and a half is too small. So, so were you at eight and a half? I was at eight and a half. Percent? I think you were lying to yourself. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. I promise you, I absolutely could fit into eight and a half. I shoes. always know you have my big foot. All bitch. of my no. I have small feet for how big I am. I guess that's true. I have small feet for how big I am. Because my little sister wears like a ten. Yeah, I know. I know. I definitely know people, tall people who have big feet. I'm not one of them. I had a She's average. Like, I'm literally not like that. That's literally. They're not, not like me. us. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, you big footed. Bitches. Um, no, I respect people with big feet. I just am not. I always wore an eight and a half. Always. I all my Doc Martens, I have to sell them all. They're all size eight. Because you do eight or not, it's whole sizes only. They're all size eight. None of them fit anymore. I can't wear any of them. And you remember how much I wore all of those shoes. The fucking red boots, the blue boots. I wore those red boots any fucking chance I could. I wore those into the ground. Mm. They will they do not fit. What size am I? I think you are a seven and a half. That's what I would tell people. Are you an eight? Uh-huh. Ah. So that's why you were projecting onto me. Yeah, yeah. I also I was like, you lied about like, your shoes. If I do, I've always lied about the size of my foot. Okay. Either to say it's, it's bigger good. or smaller. Why do you need to say Because when I was younger, and I was like in fourth grade, I thought it'd be cool if I wore a size six. Oh, like that's time. like an adult size. Yeah, I'm like, yeah, I wore size six. Sure. Well, four okay. and a half foot. Now, oh yeah, seven, seven and a half. Yeah. Seven, seven and a half. Eight. But how do you, why would you do that? Because what if they, what if the person buys you the wrong size? Well, because the people who need to know, they know, you know. Eight, size eight. Got size it. Size eight. Do you want any of my Doc Martens? <laughs> <laughs> no. Uh, yeah, some of them. <laughs> I've seen the lives that they No, I took. Oh, yeah, exactly. Okay. I don't know if I can handle another one, so I'm just gonna go ahead and watch you. Watch you slay like you always do. Period, girl. What's my biggest stoner pet peeve? This is a hard one. This one is really hard. I have to think about that. I don't even know what mine is. I know. Yeah, I think I, you know, might have. Might have a few. I think I have one. Okay. Well, I don't know if I'm gonna. Maybe, maybe we should just state our biggest stoner pet peeve. Then we. I want to guess yours. I want to guess yours. I don't. I need to think about it. Um, too. when somebody consistently doesn't throw in on. <gasps> oh, okay. That's funny. Okay, because no, no, it's not your biggest. Consistently doesn't no. Like if they like rely on you. No, that doesn't. Okay. That actually, because what I was gonna say is that. It bothers me when people don't share because oh, I sorry. I am very sharing. I'm very sharing. Yeah, I'm yeah. very generous. But also that's because in general for the last almost 10 years now, I've had a big fat stash of weed. Yeah, yeah, that yeah, is yeah. we like we are more fortunate yeah, yeah, in that yeah, way, yeah. you know. No, yeah, I actually enjoy sharing sure. with people that well, it looks like I had a smoke. <laughs> I feel like yours would be like people who are like super like snobby because that also annoys me. I forgot about that. Yeah, no, Some I hate that are, shit. Oh yeah. my God, when people think they're better than you because of what they smoke. Yes, or how. Literally lick my butthole. Yeah, you're not cool. Be my bidet. Can I just say, just the fact that you said bidet right now, I need to say this out loud. There's no bidet at this house. And I am, once you bidet, you never. The day you bidet, there's no <laughs> other way. <laughs> Exactly that. Okay, how many 
mil or milligrams can I handle in an edible? Okay, like max, 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 max. I, no, I think it should be like how casual? many? Yeah, how many can I handle and not get like sick? You could even say a range if you needed to. Between a small range. Between 30 and 50. Definitely between 30 and 50. Yeah. For sure. Yeah. I would even say maybe between 30 and 40. Yeah. yeah. 50 is like max, max, max. Yeah, like 50 is like I need to go to sleep. Yeah, like, very that. But yeah. she's not sick. She's nonverbal. She's nonverbal. <laughs> she is definitely nonverbal at 50. Oh my god. She's nonverbal at 25. You never get sick. I feel like so that's not the threshold the limit does not exist yeah I mean it really doesn't yeah it doesn't I've done a thousand yeah which if I did that like I'm not even kidding I might be one of those people that calls 911 because I have a heart attack <laughs> like a thousand I, I remember not. when I did that thousand milligrams there was a point where I like just finished all my filming right which was <laughs> fucking hard to do and I was laying down on my bed and I just like kind of slumped onto it and I was like curled up in a really uncomfortable position with my neck and I was laying there just like, oh, I'm so uncomfortable. Like, you can't do anything about it? And then I was like, <laughs> I can move. <laughs> and I like undid my little body and like laid back down. And I was like, this is nice. <laughs> <laughs> that is hilarious. Yeah, for a moment, I was just like, it's all over. I'm so uncomfortable. What's going on? How many tattoos do I have? Do you know the number? I have to think about it. I feel like it's upwards of 20. Yeah, it is that. You. Yeah. Let me think about that too. Okay. Do you have eight? I think there's more than that. One, two, three, four, five, nine. Nine. Yeah, nine. Nine. I was one off. Yeah. Ah, that's a pretty good that's guess. Pretty that's good. a pretty, that's pretty good, good guess. That's pretty good. Let me like let me really think about it. So I have 13 of these. Oh right. Wow. So 13. Oh, so there's like more than 30 probably. So, but and here's also the thing. This is one tattoo, but it was two different sessions by two different artists. Oh, like so I don't know how to. That's to, one because you added on to it. So right? adding on to it is still one tattoo. It's still the same tattoo. Okay, cool. So, but the fingers work is added on to right, that. Right. So wow. that was part of this hand I session. I think this could this, be one. I think yeah, hand one, three, four, twenty-two, twenty-three. RuPaul twenty-six, uh, twenty-seven, twenty-eight. I love that RuPaul was the. It was like the push pass moment. Like, yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. no, no we RuPaul. got we got one more. I think twenty-nine. Twenty-nine tattoos. So twenty more than I. I do. I don't know. I oh, I oh no, because I forgot about this one. 30. Oh my god. I just remembered I have my lip too. <laughs> so dead. We're not claiming that one. It's <laughs> not showing it. How many piercings do I have? At least seven. Maybe ten. No, not ten. Yeah, I think it's seven. It's seven. I have two in each ear. That's four. My one in my nose. Five. You have two right there though. They're they're closed. Okay. Yeah. Both titties. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the clip. <laughs> No, my belly one. That was seven. I don't think I could do it. I've never gotten a piercing and been like, oh, I wouldn't do that again. Like every single time I'm like, yeah, fuck yeah. Fuck I love God. them, but I don't think I could do my pussy. How many do I have? Uh, okay, so this is, I feel like pretty easy. The belly button, so one. You just have one in each ear? Three. At a certain point, I had two, but these ones have closed I, If we counted all of my closed ones, I would have like a lot. 10 in my in each ear. Yeah. So I have two open ones that have been pierced since I was like three months old. Okay, yeah. Just the lobe, yeah. Yeah. Um, belly button. Yeah, so three. Three. Slay. What is my favorite stoner technology? Or like accessory. So we're talking about like electronic devices. Well, I feel like. Or could it just be like about, an innovation? When I yeah, when I think about mine, it's not an electronic device. But I okay. do feel like yours, like an e-rig, would be pretty high up for you. Let me think about it. My favorite innovative stoner device. So I actually was going to guess that this yeah. because you've been using it so much. But I now have. you said it's not an electronic. So. It's just the first the thing that came to mind the most that I'm like I that's like a stoner thing that I can't live without. In Is it a poker? It's, yeah, it's <laughs> the toker poker where it has the lighter and the poker. Yeah, okay. When I don't have my toker poker, sometimes Adam takes it outside to smoke like a cigar <laughs> or something. And if, if it's not in the place where I need it to be, I'm like, where's the toker? Poker? No, I think poker is an understated item that a lot of people don't think about. Yeah. Yeah. But I got it. Second try. Yes, you did. Well, first try was not electronic. Right. And you would be, I mean, I do love this thing, but like if we're going favorite electronic yeah, device yeah. ever. I want to just one day, I want somebody to compile all the times of us saying that Puffco is the best fucking device because they are. 
They really are. And I want them to know that we say that about them on mm -hmm. fucking regular For basis. free. Because we mean it. Mm -hmm. Okay, how much do I smoke in a day? Okay, are we like quantifying grams or like number of bong grips? I think number of bong grips. Okay, so number suffice. of bong grips, I would say four or five. That's a really good, that's what I, yes. I. That's, yeah. that's a really good guess. Yeah. That's what I would say, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I would say for you, maybe like 10 to 15. That's perfect. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I was thinking too. <laughs> what is my biggest fear? It's very easy. Is it? It's a small, not like small, but like, so it's very basic. Like dying? No. But like, yeah, it's just like a basic ass fear. It's not like anything special. You don't know this one. No, I don't know. <laughs> That's okay. But it's uh, the dark. Oh. I am, I hate the dark. Oh, yeah, which like translates into like a fear of the unknown. Like I think space is really, really scary. The movie Gravity, horror film. Gravity, oh. With Sandra Bullock. Oh, it's a horror, oh. No, it's not the fuck, <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> to me, it, it's a horror film because <gasps> flying through blackness in space just watching the world get further away. I can't think of anything more terrifying in my, it, I, I would rather look a barracuda down the throat than fly through space. Great white shark, kiss it on the mouth. <laughs> Over flying through space. Absolutely not, tear me apart. Tear me apart. <laughs> that, I mean, that is scary. I am gonna have the mother load of anxiety attacks. Like I might explode in the suit. Just like I don't even have to die, I'm just gonna, ah! <laughs> it just turns into a. That, what better way to die, honestly? Just, than just... spontaneous combustion. <laughs> yeah. All right, okay. your biggest fear. Uh, yeah. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I think there might be something weird and deep rooted with 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 certain traumas that have happened in your life. <sighs> I think you're afraid of things happening to the people you love. You fucking bitch. That's not what I thought, but, but it is. that's super, yeah. What is, what's what you thought? No, I was gonna say that mine's really basic too and that like getting like attacked or something would be. <laughs> Valid fear. I also have a, I have a thing about being like in the shower, like somebody breaking into my house when I'm in the shower, yeah. Okay, why would you do One that? One time. Oh, sometimes I'll FaceTime Rajul when I have to wash my face in the shower and I'm like, okay, watch my back. Yeah. Just to make sure. <laughs> sure One time there. when I was like freaking like much younger, my ex-boyfriend, I was in the shower and he like came into the bathroom without me knowing and I like just looked over my shoulder and could see him and I started like crying. That's terrible. But I didn't, I wasn't, you I, didn't I, know I, I was crying uncontrollably. Yes, yeah. uncontrollably. I like felt like I was just so scared. I had been so scared that I just started crying yeah I, yeah I do think about that every single time I love it when my dogs come and sit next to me when I'm in the shower I'm like perfect my dogs spot. do this thing where they'll run up and down the halls barking <laughs> which really soothes my nerves <laughs> totally me being scared to that of something happening to yeah, the yeah, people yeah, that yeah, I yeah, love yeah. is very very real for yeah, sure yeah, yeah. I am constantly <laughs> concerned for everyone's safety and I'm like Please don't. Yeah. That's okay. It's very deep rooted. Deep rooted. For sure. <laughs> deep rooted fear. So, okay, we have one more. Last one. Here we go. Okay, if I could smoke with one celebrity, who would it be? This is a hard one, for sure. I honestly feel like we might have the same one if I said it out loud. Okay. Doja Cat. That's not who I was thinking of, but now that you hear it, I'm like, oh my god, I cannot. Like, if myself. I could sesh with you with one other person, <laughs> Amala, oh my god. Amala, please, oh come, my god, come, yes. come up. We got a spot for you right here. Yes. Oh my god, honestly, dream blunt rotation for sure. I my brain went to Beyonce, but that's not. Don't you get is way more uh, like, hilarious. Yeah. Do you know what a key that would be? Yeah. Beyonce gonna just not even I would hit just, the blunt because paparazzi. No, this is not. That's that's not a factor in this question. Oh, so it's we're trusted allies. Yes. Got it. We're trusted allies. Wow. Doja Cat is a really good one. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah she was the first one that came to mind for me. Well, she came to mind for me for you, and I was like, same. Yeah. <laughs> Like yeah. also same oh my god! Can I think of a better person to complete or, or to because like become a trio, like a per, like a person that you really admire versus a person that you really want to smoke with? Totally, or like different things. Different things. Exactly. Yeah. And she seems like she'd be fucking funny to smoke yeah, with. Yeah, dude. Just yeah, to like be vibe. Able to Good be vibe. Friends with. I feel like she's probably hilarious. Hilarious. Just a weirdo. Yeah. Well, I can tell that she's hilarious because I understand her sense of humor. Yeah. Yeah. I remember one time she posted like it was a Reddit thing. It was uh -huh. a photo from Reddit, and it was like. 
chicken and rice with like mayonnaise. <laughs> And she was, she was like, mm, so yummy and creamy. And like posted it, just like a post on her page. And I was like, I know she's trolling. Yeah. I know she knows that people are going to see this and think she's being for real. And the Shade Room reposted oh it. Oh my God. And people were just like, what the fuck is wrong with Doja Cat? Like, yeah, she's so right. fucking gross. Who's cooking in this house? And I literally left a comment. I was like, this is a picture from Reddit, y'all. It got like 14,000 likes. You and your comments. Yeah, I really slang. go ham sometimes. Yeah, because obviously it's a fucking joke. You stupid people. Do you think that she's so fucking unaware of what good food looks like, A, and B, being a fucking superstar, think that she would be dumb enough to post that heinous ass plate on social media, knowing that people scrutinize every fucking thing that she does? Obviously, they think she's stupid. She's That's basically what I've learned, is people think she's a fucking idiot. Yeah. From the does truth. she have zero situational awareness? Who else would post that? <laughs> Somebody with zero situational awareness. Or, or, or hear me out, they're fucking joking. I'm like, <laughs> like does she have zero situational awareness? And I'm like, does. No. Does she? No. She, no. Does she? Would you do it? You are a superstar. Millions of people following your account. They watch everything you do. They tear you up for every fucking thing you do. You think that she's that fucking unaware of what good like she's never had good food she's a millionaire who's never had a five-star dish but there uh, are people in the comments like, who are stupid yeah. you're dumb actually that's something that i've learned like just in general is like there are so many like really stupid people those people can world. vote and they can have kids that's a situation for disaster look at this <laughs> fucking country okay it's not looking good and it's only gonna make it worse Shh. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for letting me have my moment. Slay girl. That was a slay. Wow, that was so much fun. And honestly, yeah, we got like 90% of the questions right, I would say. I think other people should do this with their stoner besties. Yeah, I agree. Make like, a little list together. Yeah. Don't discuss the answers beforehand, obviously. Yeah, we had to like stop ourselves from talking about it. We anything. had to stop ourselves from reacting to yeah. it. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, but that was really, really fun. <coughs> yeah, thank y'all so much for coming. Thank you for watching me and my bestie, Mac Dizzle. You also will be able to watch us on a video on her channel. We'll be back in here. Like, subscribe, yeah. share with your mom. Share with anybody. Everybody. Thanks for coming. Love you so much. Welcome back to my channel. I'm here with Mac Dizzle today. Sorry, oh. I, just, I got spooked. Hey. Oh, I heard something. <laughs> <laughs> That's my uncle back there. Where are you guys yeah. off to? You're just no, we're not. No, we're, no, we're, we're filming. filming a video. Yeah. We were just smoking in the car. Yeah, we yeah, are going to yeah, be doing that. Doing. Don't hold back. I mean, and we won't be. Thinking about me. I mean, oh, yeah, yeah, whatever. Dude, if you want some. No, I'm just kidding. No, <laughs> seriously, you let me know. Are we filming right now? Yeah. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> But later on, when we're not filming, I did not inhale. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to end up like 100 by me. <laughs> oh my god, no, that's crack. Oh. Yeah. You guys have fun. Okay, Thank yeah, you. we'll do it. Let me know if you want some weed. Oh, I, I got you. I, I, when nobody's around. Yeah. Hey, yeah. that's the right yeah, time exactly. to do it. And that's when you can be weird and no one knows. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna start over. <laughs> 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 <laughs>